Welcome to another episode of the Kin Seed series, and we have had a pretty big update on the experimental branch. What even is that branch called? <laughs> preview? I think it's called a preview branch. <laughs> okay, let's get back into the game. Here we are. So, we don't have a pop up in the mailbox, maybe just because this is in the preview branch instead of being an actual official update. So, or what the update has is you turn what this update has is you become an adult when you change 20 and we are currently 16 I think yes 16 sorry why is it only when I record kin seed that you insist on getting on the desk <laughs> I do not understand so uh, you have a couple years we may uh go into the forest and cost us a couple of lives so <laughs> we can become 20 soon. Uh, they've added something called the life mirror. The dating first pass has been put in to include a cat butt in the way. Locations to discover. Can create an extra custom task type so the guy- Far away! Eh. Sit over here. Can create some extra custom tasks, goddess, brownie offering, and feed pet, which is all very good because I forget those kinds of things. So would that be in here? New task. Great task. Feed the pigs, feed the dog, but we don't have those. Give an offering, a brownie offering, goddess offering. So we can go ahead and do next. This task will repeat. Confirm. Make a brownie offering. And it gives you a little bit of information. Don't forget to do it though. They have right old temper. Very good. Let's do one for the goddess as well. Because that one I really uh, struggle with. Give an uh, goddess offering. Yeah. So now we can make sure to check this every day. And do these things. God, we still haven't found John. Bows. Bows should give him his blood fume. Alright, go ahead and give that a close. Apparently I've been talking to you from the back of my head. What else do we got? Animal food likes and dislikes have been improved on, which would be really nice if it adds more um, options. I mean, one of the reasons I don't have a dog is because I didn't feel like I could feed it well enough at the, at the time. Let's pick some food. What else do we have? Some improvements around following navigation, though there's more to be done there. So this has to do both with, uh, I think, pets following you and with, more importantly, dates. So NPCs can follow you on a date from what I've seen. Um, so they wanted to make sure that was working well. They've improved to improvements to offering statue worship state. So we may go look at that in a little bit. There's stuff we could do here to look at first. So new uh, effects for several player actions, monument stone, UI update. This is in progress. Are these called monument stones up here? The um, like the family tree ones. Let's go check this out. Oh, that does look quite different. For one, it now has like a stony background. We have a. Um, this must be the overall family attitude towards you. I'm surprised there's not some kind of marker to say like this person has passed. That's probably in part in the in progress part. And our siblings not a fan. All right, what else? A glow for home offering shrine gifted. Which is a weird way of saying that when you gift to the bowl, it should glow. Let's give him an apple. Oh, ooh, new sound effects too. So now it's, I think it's gonna permanently stay that way so you can look and see that you've donated. You don't have to come over and try to donate to know. So that's very useful. World map background scroll with movement. Not entirely sure what world map background scrolls with movement. So here is the world map, I assume. Uh, the background scrolls with movement. So, I mean, it feels different, but I don't really know how it's different. 
if it is different or it's just one of those like I'm looking for a difference so it feels different um, but here is the world map there have been some updates to some of the level maps to be a higher resolution which is always nice they've done some tidying up on some of the tasks after the first season so after like the tutorial area NPC status now shows friendship level and an indicator on how far until the level goes up. It's like a progress bar for your friendship. From what I'm gathering, they've adjusted some of the shadow offset for NPCs, so NPC shadows should look a bit nicer. Uh, adjusted the frequency of illness from the lack of food to be a bit slower. That's not actually something we have much experience with. Just because I'm paranoid. Oh! Funny enough, after um, last episode where I said that the screen really was jumpy after riding a pig and running into something, they actually had already fixed that, so that's good. They did some work with um, memory, so that there's less crashes uh, due to out-of-memory issues. They did a fix for uh, a quest here in Druda's Cross where lost items weren't actually being lost there. Uh, they've You can assign swords to combat hotbar using number keys, friendship point consequence for not completing a task when it expires, so note to self, don't take a cat quest. I don't think I could finish in time. <laughs> um, they made it so the NPC quest markers will remove if the task is removed. And they made a fix for NPCs wandering off when playing the loot. So the loot is something we don't really have or haven't experienced, haven't experimented with, but they can put people to sleep. So they should now actually go to sleep if they're not immune. Let's look at the goddess offering. Looks a bit the same. Life and death. Uh... Okay, so now you can see a little... I don't know if this was here or not before, but you could see what we were donating and like the star of it. Just give it a, a flower. Confirm. New sound effect. Very good. But that is it for the change log, and so what I want to do is go back up to Loverwood, I think. Yes. Ooh, we could travel straight there. Okay, and look at this in the day. Ah, there you are. You no longer look like a bed because you're actually awake. There's Roger readily. Greetings. How are you? You need some sleep. We're not friends, so you won't gossip. <laughs> What's this book? Excuse me. Oh, this is fun music. <laughs> so, uh, conception art. Woods in the woods. Who is- what is creation? Who created us? What does it mean to be created? And then create creations that create creations that create creations. Whew. These questions have been asked since time immemorial, although maybe not quite like that. <laughs> not quite. In the world we call Quill, conception is enhanced by mating at certain pools or glades. Maybe an ancient tree that radiates power. In a junkyard, perhaps, at midnight. The energies of creation ebb and flow through these special places, so what might be good fun at dawn might not yield a fertile seed. However, hit the same magical spot at dusk and the chances may be increased. It is best to learn the best times and locations from locals who will have flattened a bit of grass in their time. It also helps to chew on certain foods or partake in certain special virility vir, vir, virility potions although i have heard of a man who can't swallow performance enhancing herb and got a stiff neck <laughs> uh Nad nadia the goddess of fertility is also a good source of help when you feel the need feel the need to seed making offers to her or worshiping at her fertility statues is sure to aid in gaining the gift of creation wow it's already so dark. Right. Defeats the point of coming here in the day if we don't make it here during the day. <laughs> oh, there's another building. Okay. We have a chest. Can't do anything with. Interesting. 
I feel like this wasn't here yesterday or the last time I recorded, but uh, I don't know if I came across this bridge. Ooh, mapstone. How are you supposed to catch that fish? <laughs> Or not, that's the answer. Ooh, what's this? Oh, the rose of romance. Love blossoms when you hand those to your dearest. Just watch out for pricks. <laughs> oh, secret hidey spot. Oh, no. There we go. Discovered a date location. Lovers laugh. Neat. I wonder how many more of these there are. I hope I read that right. I feel like it was a little quick. Wow, that, that light was sudden. Let's see. So I wonder if I need to rediscover places that I've already discovered for these dating locations. Nope, here's another date location. The Watcher. <laughs> I feel like those um, <coughs> pop up a little quick. Rather, they like disappear quickly. Like, it's hard to read them fast enough if you're a slow reader like me. This looks like a bear. Do you see that? Here's an eye, an eye, a nose. It's got a little face. Ooh, night berries. Only sprouts at night, amazingly. This one's so aggressive when you open up, the whole middle is all caps. <laughs> um. I don't know if this is one we've read. I think so, but it's been a while. But it's the laws. Run away before Winky gets here. Oh man, I didn't even think of the crops. Let's get these guys watered before bed. I'll harvest the other stuff later. I wonder if some of these signs will disappear like once you get older or like after the first season. Like, look at the status of crops to see if they need watering. Like, you kind of eventually know how to do that, and then it's just kind of more text on the screen when you use that button. I'm not sure. Ah, good morning. Let's go ahead and get some blueberries. Yay! Still not entirely sure why you want to use this tool on these things. It may just be one of those- ooh, okay, guess I'm planting that as well. Um, it may be one of those things that has more use later. Alright, so let's check the calendar. Ooh, there's little stars now. I guess that just means there's something special happening. Yeah. The 5th and 12th, just not cool days, apparently. What day is it? 6th. Is there a way to tell what day it is if you click off? No. Then you just close it and open it up again. Uh, pig market. I think we have two bacon, so... Two bacon. <laughs> oh my god. I think we have two pigs, so I think we're fine. Uh, wow, there's no fairy paths put in anywhere over here. It's unfortunate. <laughs> Had it taken a different traveling situation had I realized that. <sighs> Alright. I imagine again that's something that'll maybe be updated later. Or it'll be a different perk. Like another thing you need to get from Fairweather. Ooh! You can use the little uh, sickle on like plants that you want to harvest. You can use it on this guy. Yep. Haha. Ooh! How have I not found that map stone before? <laughs> I guess I didn't really uh, go through here much before. Oh, here's a monument stone. Found the history of Apple of my iPad. Aha, aha. Those are the two people who do pies or like baked goods. Oh, date location, Baker Grove. I do need to just go over and find all of the little cool spots. Oh, hello there. Can't remember what your name is, but I recognize you. Poppy Seed. Oh, well, hello, sapling. You look like a person who could show a girl the darkest corners of the forest. We should go explore them sometimes. You bring the wood, and I will make the fire. Whoa. 
It's funny because a lot of these wouldn't seem innuendo-ish if it wasn't in this context, but when everything looks the way it does in this area. <laughs> Ooh, another map stone. I did it! Look. Ooh. This is... I feel like we need to eventually be able to move the maps. Though I don't know how much of this is being cropped off. Like, I think down here is like you travel once you get to this point. So maybe the map can be moved. Ooh. Okay, so they show date locations on the map. That's cool. Head up this way because we haven't gotten this on the world map. Nadia's glory. Ah. Oh, here's a goddess stone. Good. Oh. We got have we donated? So we only have life and rebirth. Ugh. Hello, anybody home? Ah, uh, yep, yep, I see you. Okay. Grab this book. <laughs> uh, Alright, I guess I'll read it. <laughs> the line that got me was uh, this one over here. Since the dawn of dawn, humanity has sought to reproduce for survival of the species and for recreation. And that's, face it, that's the fun one. In olden times, the men would chase a woman and drag her by her hair to his cave where they would make cavelings. As time went on, the male became more polite and would climb on top of mountains and kill indigenous tribes to prove his love for his lady. More time passed and the woman now took command with her new freedoms and men were left to compete in gladi glad glad gladiatorial arenas in a thing called television. After the catastrophes that befell mankind, the basic need for survival resurfaced. Now, in our modern times, creation of, creating a child is all a matter of courting your lover with the gift of a rabbit corn doll. Then, lead them to a place known to increase virility. Gotta look at learn how to say that word. And don't forget to eat things to enhance your sensual abilities. Play a game of hide and seek to prove your worth, then take them back to a loving spot for copulation. If the goddess likes what they see, then a stork will deliver your baby in one week. How did humans never use this system from the start? It would have saved a lot of innocent pickles from being devoured by hungry pregnant females. <laughs> uh, creepy goddesses? They like what they see. <laughs> Guess they don't got the internet. They gotta watch somehow. Oh, map stone. And blood feud? Blood feud? Yes. There's another house out here. Ah, this is where the bug man lives. Where is your monument stone? Dang it. Oh, here's his one. <sighs> Canines. Ooh, map stone. And a poppy. Oh, and this was a... What was it called? Ah, poop. This must be a dating spot. I think it said the nook something. Uh huh. Yes. The <laughs> the nuki nick nook. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Ooh, but this is another hidey hole date spot. Nope. Maybe eventually though. Moonfish have a powerful trait. They keep you up until way past late. Which is kind of interesting because, like, does that mean it's only useful for ch for children? Because. I could stay up until dawn, I think. I've never passed out before, so. I guess it's now just my life. I water my crops at midnight. Because <laughs> I think you have 24 hours from like when you watered it last sort of a deal, so. Because I watered last night. They weren't ready to be watered in the morning. I'll just have to wait till it rains. Or I harvest everything. Sugar. Ah, speaking of the rain, thank you. Ooh. Don't know what that's for. <laughs> so because I completed my own tasks. Quick hit all the tasks. Oh yeah. So I got coin and it didn't repeat. So give goddess offering. It says task will repeat, but it didn't. And go ahead and put Oh, plant and harvest. Select one option per task. That's not what I meant, but... Oh, it's Druid Day. Hopefully I remember to go down to the festival grounds next episode. But I'm gonna have to go ahead and end this episode. 
It always takes a bit longer to go through the change lists and I write a couple things, so. I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.